Good morning, folks. Welcome, observers. Today, we're going to see another huge update in Earth's magnetic pole shift. They're beginning to flood after the field of science woke up last year. I told you, going to be a fun year. We've also got weather and space weather to hit, and this is the last 24 hours on our star. Hello, coronal hole. The southern opening extends northward trans-equatorially, probably should be colored electric pink or blue. Its solar wind is two days away, and beneath the roiling plasma in the corona, we descend down to the photosphere, and we find the sunspots. M-class flares is all we've taken so far, not going to complain about that. These can produce Earth-directed eruptions over the next couple days, so we are eyes open on the active regions for that activity today, tomorrow, and the next day. Quick weather note. They're really doubling down here. I would be fascinated if we got snow all the way down deep into the Gulf states, but they sure think it's possible today. All depends on how widely the pressure cells drive the southern cold flow behind the precipitation. Our top story today? Oof. We heard whispers of this at AGU 2025, but now here it is, peer-reviewed and published. And folks, it's that worst news about the field. Remember this? The Earth field model is degrading quickly. Every vector is failing to capture how fast things are changing after the 2024 geomagnetic jerk that powerfully impacted Europe and North America. They forecast nothing but continued deviation between the model and reality. Next geomagnetic jerk is due in 2028. But most importantly, in 2019, they had to release the first ever out-of-cycle field update because of how much the field was changing. They assured us it was an anomaly, that it was slowing down, and don't be afraid of the pole shift. Here we are, less than seven years later. However, they're essentially saying they're going to have to do it again. Every single one of you knows exactly what that means. If you're brand new here, though, my God, I am so sorry. Please do your best to catch up with the videos in the description box below or on my channel homepage. Everyone, we are one month from the Dallas Winter Tour event. However, that is sold out. There are only tickets left for Las Vegas in March, and there's only about eight of those left. The tour is likely to fully sell out this coming week. And when we're looking at the longer schedule, this might be the only time Alon and I get to do the experience this year. Are you 100% certain of your mental, spiritual, and physical invincibility when the sun turns red and your children are screaming? I am, and so are the attendees. Link below, three weeks away. After that, and the last two tour events, everything is going to be at Observer Ranch until next fall. Links to all of those events can be found below, and at every single one of them, the prepper essentials you aren't going to survive this without are delivered, like getting a consulting session with Faith. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.